The government's announced the full makeup of three commando brigade who will become the lead British contingent in Afghanistan from April next year. They'll replace 16 air assault brigade on Operation Herrick 14 with the bulk of the 9,500 troops coming from the Desert Rats, 7th Armour Brigade in Germany. Annie Hairsign reports from Hona. Fun and farewells for the Desert Rats as they say goodbye in style to their outgoing brigade commander, Brigadier Nick Welsh. Each unit of 7th Armour Brigade has used one of their rare days of downtime to prepare exercises to test their brigadier's skills and sense of humour. But it's also been the day Parliament has officially announced that many of these troops will be deploying to Helmand Province next March on Herrick 14. Three Commander Brigade will be replacing 16 Air Assault Brigade for the third time since 2006. So for these troops lining the route out of camp for their commander's final journey as a desert rat, after Christmas leave, it's back to pre-deployment training with their new operational partners. Operation Herrick 14 definitely has a Royal Marine Commando lid on it. It's, it's certainly a full partnership with 7th Armoured Brigade who are based in Germany. We've been training very well and very hard with, with 7th Armoured Brigade over the last few months and that will continue for the next three months prior to our deployment um, in March and April next year. For the past three months, troops from 7th Armoured Brigade have been concentrating their efforts on preparations for Afghanistan. 3,500 soldiers from the majority of the units based here in bergen hone garrison will support 3 Commander Brigade as their combat force. They include 3-2 Engineer Regiment, the Royal Scots Dragoon Guards and soldiers from 3 Mercians. Elements from 3 Commander Brigade include the newly formed 30 Commando Information Exploitation Group, as well as 4-5 Commando from Arbroath, 4-2 Commando based in Plymouth, and the Commando Logistic Regiment based in Barnstable. Most of the training has taken place in the UK, where 3 Commando's new combined force has been working together for the last couple of months. And here in Germany, the soldiers have been learning the local language, Pashto, so they can talk to local Afghans. They're also mastering the various new vehicles they'll be using once they reach Helmand province next March. Annie Hairsign, Forces News, Hona.